Good six. Heavy equipment will soon move in on Texas Street in Mobile. The flood prone residential street is about to undergo millions in improvements. NBC 15's Justin Moore joins us now live. Justin, city leaders say the neighborhood will look a lot different a year and a half from now. That's right, and uh, they say everything is big in Texas. I guess they were talking about these potholes as well on Texas Street here in Mobile. Uh, take a look at this one. This one is pretty deep here. Now, city leaders are telling these potholes to count their days. This type of flooding is nothing new for Bill Stafford. We've had water up to the second step, uh, second from the bottom. Stafford has been living on Texas Street for 43 years. Over time, this street has been getting worse. Besides flooding after heavy rain, it has deep potholes and uneven pavement. Citizens ought to expect better, and I'm glad that as government, we're able and in a position to give better. Behind the scenes, District 2 Councilman LaVon Manzi says he has been working for years to get this piece of infrastructure replaced. Several years later, it's finally about to happen. What we've done at Ann Street, what's being completed at Baltimore Street, this just makes sense to move forward, and I'm glad that we're in a position to do so. With the help of Moz and Mobile County Commission, $6 million is going into Texas Street between Ann and Broad Street. New sidewalks, gas, water, and sewage lines, and storm drains will replace dated infrastructure. Most of it is going to predate our records, which means it's going to be over 70. About half of the water is going to be about 70 years old. Almost all of the sewer is that age. Mayor Sandy Stimson says this project fits into the plan to revitalize Broad Street, which will eventually lead to the new downtown airport terminal. But I would say right now that that part of Broad Street will not start until this is completed. A project that could take upwards to 18 months to complete, one Stafford has been waiting for since Dallas was a hit on TV. It'll be worth it when, when it gets through, and we appreciate the city doing it. Now, a lot of residents here on Texas Street can't believe this project is about to happen. Some didn't even know until they pulled up and asked us why we're out here, and we told them. Now, the heavy equipment should be moving in pretty soon. Uh, they should get started work. Uh, sometime at the start of October. Live out here on Texas, Texas Street in Mobile, Justin Moore, NBC 15 News.